So before I forget, I do want to play a little clip of what this microphone on the headset sounds like so that you can get an idea of what the actual microphone sounds like. So I wanted to make this realistic. What you are hearing right now is the exact same room, but it's with my air conditioner going. For those of you that are also living in a warmer area, with an air conditioner going and all that kind of stuff. Now, I am also recording this with my air conditioner on at the exact same time with my Audio Technica microphone. Just due to reasons I doubt that I need to explain, the microphone on this headset does sound pretty good, but it is definitely not going to be the exact same quality. Now, as far as the sound quality goes with this headset, when I say good, what I mean is it is it's more natural than it is super bassy or super trebly and as far as i can tell there is not a way to change the audio that is coming out of it i know that there is a mute button somewhere for the for the micro oh, for the microphone um but that's really it you got you got your you got your mute on and then you got your unmute on and then you got the rgb whether you want the rgb on or if you don't want it on, um, it is only one color. And real quick, just wanted to say that if you would like a PC from me, my Facebook business page is linked down in the description below. I do not charge you anything other than the cost of parts, which I do in fact give you a full list of everything with the final cost before I order it all with my own money. You do not pay me anything until you see the video, the performance, the benchmarks, and all of that kind of stuff. So again, link down in the description below. Have the audio, and if you do need to plug in and uh, plug it in with this rather than the USB, you can use this, plug it into something, and you'll, you'll be able to use the audio through that. I do kind of wish that this little thing was either on the headset or down below because it does look kind of weird having a wire coming out here and then also i'll just show you right now since that's what we're doing so that you know what i mean it, it kind of looks weird with the wire uh, maybe if that if this portion was a little bit longer it wouldn't be as bad but because it's so close just having that hanging out even if you like wrap it around like that it just doesn't look very good and i'm guessing that most people getting this headset are getting it for the aesthetic part of it because it, it is a very cool looking headset um, but the sound quality in it it doesn't over bass everything and it doesn't over trebleize everything like there's a lot of gaming headsets that for that are aimed at fps games that will increase the treble and all that kind of stuff with the headset that way you can hear footsteps easier you can hear the shots easier and you can hear like the whatever the nitty gritty details in the game easier and then there's there's uh headsets for music that they it, it increases the bass that way the the bass in the music that you're listening to is higher and these sound more natural so when you're listening to a podcast it is going to be the natural audio from whoever created that podcast or if you talk into a microphone that is unedited that is what you are going to hear back and i personally like that i think that that is a much better way to go about a headset rather than increasing a bunch of treble and it just makes everything sound unnatural so i mean overall i recommend it it, it i mean it does come with the the surround sound 7.1 it obviously is going to uh, be supported on both console and PC and then the microphone does have the active noise cancellation which is literally why I have my air conditioner on going back there so that you guys could get an idea of what that sounded like.